Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equations. So now I want to show you how to answer. For this one, we just find only complementary solution. So I will put about yc equals to e to the power of lambda s because we have number zero in here that's why we just have only complementary solution later that we do first the derivative of yc and we have lambda e to the power of lambda s so if we do first the derivative of this one we keep the same e to the power of lambda s later that we do first the derivative of lambda s you got lambda now we go to second derivative of yc and we have lambda square e to the power of lambda s and third derivative of yc and we have lambda to the power of 3 e to the power of lambda s now we have this one so i will put this one go in here this one go in here and this one go in here and the last one go in here so we have like this So we have e to the power of lambda s. We can do about factorization. And now we need, need to find the solutions of this one. So if we want to find this one, we have lambda equals to number one, lambda equals to negative number one, and lambda equals to positive number six. So after we have this one, we will have about yc equals to c number one, e to the power of lambda s. And now we need to put number one going here. So we have e to the power of s and we have c number 2 e to the power of negative s and c number 3 e to the power of 6 s. Now we have the conditions. The first thing we need to find First, the derivative of yc and second, the derivative of yc in here. So if we do first, the derivative of yc, we have like this. And second, the derivative of yc, we have like this. And now we put number 0, 0, 0 going here for S. And we will have about the system of equations. So for the first one, they should be like this. Because e to the power of 0, we have number 1. And this one, we have negative number 3. The second one, we have C1 minus C2 plus 
this C3 equals to number 1. And the second and the last one, we have C1 plus C2 plus 36. C number 3 equals to negative number 2. So we can find the solutions of C1, C2, C3 in here. So we have C1 equals to negative 11 over 10. C2, we have negative 27 over 14. And C number 3 equals to 1 over 35. And now we know that we can find the final answer. So why C that is about this one. And now we just put the number cone here. This is the end. Thank you for watching.